first Friends of Libya conference held on Thursday, September 1st in France. Dignitaries from 60 countries and world organizations met with members of Libya's National Transition Council to discuss the nation's transition to a democratic government. During the meeting, participants promised to lift a freeze on 15 billion U.S. dollars in Libyan funds to assist in the country's rebuilding as they also agreed that the United Nations would head up efforts to assist the nation's new leadership. As French President Nicolas Sarkozy urged for national reconciliation and forgiveness, U.S. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton reiterated pledges of support for Libya's democratic transition, as she also stated that the new government should be given the country's seat at the United Nations. Finally, National Transition Council Chief Mustafa Abdel Jalil highlighted the importance of a Libyan focus on peace. As he stated, we have to make sure that we fulfill our side of the deal. We must have security in Libya. Tolerance and forgiveness must be promoted, and the state of law must be respected. Friends of Libya and National Transition Council participants, we are thankful for your forward-thinking efforts to support the Libyan people. May your goals be swiftly realized for the restoring of a stable society where all residents flourish in safety, dignity, and peace.